Hello, let's see how GeoGebra can help us to study some statistics. Here I have some data with some pupils. Actually, they must be little kids, their length and their shoe size. So I want to do some statistics with the data. First, I choose the length data and I click on one variable analysis and I click analyze. GeoGebra produces a nice histogram about the data and if you click here you can get the bar chart so you see what kind of data it is. And if I want to see more numbers because I'm a math teacher I click here on show statistics. So here you see that there were 40 kids, the mean, the standard deviations, the sum of the shoe sizes and the sum of the squares and the smallest shoe size and the largest and median etc. You can also do something more if you click in here, you will get more options. You can set the classes manually if you want to. Let's say I will start 115 and let's make the bar with 3. And I can also get the frequency table here and if I change the, the width in here for example the 4 it changes it in here also and you can you could also produce the frequency polygon if you want I can of course change the, this window also in this graph button and I could also make the frequencies count it automatically. Okay, let's see what if I have this frequency table already. Let's see what I can do with GeoGebra with that kind of data. <clears throat> let's study statistics with the frequency table. Here I have a spreadsheet with the Finnish population at the end of 2015. In this column I have the Finnish age intervals, there is the interval midpoint and the total number of Finnish people in 2015 in those intervals. Let's make some statistics. I choose this data and one variable analysis. And now I want these totals in here. I choose this data in here and click in options and there is data fre frequency and there is the hand tool and it adds the selection to my data and now I click analyze and it gives me a bar chart with this data from here I get the histogram and if I want the statistics, I will get it with this so statistics too. So we see that we have a total of 5,487,308 fins and the mean age is 42.3. Here we have the standard deviations, etc. Here we can change the width of the histogram. If you choose this one you can copy the graphics to graphics view or copy to clipboard or export the graphics to export it as a picture. Save it as a file. And here you could also change the classes manually like in the first example. So let's come back to, to my length and shoe size spreadsheet and let's do some two variable statistics. 
So here I have this, these lengths and shoe sizes in here. So let's study the correlation. I choose the data in here. And now I choose from here two variable regression analysis. I click analyze and here I get the scatter plot. And if I want to see some kind of model for the regression, for example linear, I will get it in here. Here's the equation. And if I want to get the statistics, I click in here. You can change it to re residual plot, so it's the difference from the model. And you can also make changes to your graph. Maybe this is enough for simple statistical analysis with GeoGebra.